At Brazoswood High School, you can't miss the daily reminders of the school's rich baseball tradition that includes three state championships, most recently in 2011. We look out there and we see the state champs, but they're not something that we are afraid of. It's something that motivates us every day to do better. This season marks the beginning of a new era of Buccaneers baseball as longtime assistant coach Mike Cressman replaces Bobby Williams as the program's head coach. It's an honor carrying on the tradition here. We have a real long tradition here at Brazilwood of winning. Uh, started back uh, with, with Bill Poland. He, uh, he won a state championship in, in 84, 92, and uh, it carried on with Bobby Williams when he took over for Bill Poland and uh, he won a state championship in 2011. We just had a real st steep tradition here of winning and I can't tell you what a huge honor it is to take over that and be a part of that. Helping ease the transition are the Bucks 16 seniors who have grown up together and have been playing together since Little League. Most of the guys out here, we've all been playing since we were little kids, so we all have a bunch of good chemistry together, so we all bring a good, good energy to the locker room and to the field. I can be behind the plate and look at Brett at, Brett at shortstop or Andy at shortstop and kind of know what they're thinking and know what they want to do. We're already way ahead of where we were last year. You know, just, just little things, stuff that we, that we already coached last year, things like, you know, bunt coverages and first and third situations and different type of game situation type stuff. We can refer back to last year. Hey, you know, remember when this happened in this game, you know, we're going to do it like this. The Bucks can always draw upon the experiences of their alumni, including some major league players who return home to train in the offseason. Most recently, Ryan Tapera, he's still with the Blue Jays right now. It's just good for the players to see these guys. They know that, that these guys, you know, they, they played in the, on the same field, high school field as they did. They, you know, they took ground balls in the same field. They took batting practice in the same place they did, and, and they made it. We had Ryan Tapera last year come out, help us with pitching, and I got to ask a big leaguer how to throw a slider. Brazoswood also has a couple of key members who have both been around the program for more than a decade each, Willie and Bobby Jack who provide support to the program in a number of ways and help keep the dugout loose. Willie, how do we win? Stanley, the one ain't back here. Yeah. The one down, the down, hits, hits the bunt down. Oh. Two strike approach. They're just awesome to be around. They're always happy, always fun. They're, they're just really good guys. And every time they come out, they're in a good mood. I mean, the, the, the kids love them. They're, they're like family to us. They've been here longer than me, and I've been here a long time. Anything we need, they're here to help us. I know Willie helps us in the game. He does pitch count. I mean, he's right on. The guy never misses. And uh, Bobby Jack, he's great, too. He always keeps it light, keeps it airy in here. I mean, he's probably the best dancer in uh, Brazoria County. Add it all together, and the Bucks expect to once again be one of the top baseball teams in the area. I think we can be really good, honestly. And ultimately, our goal is to go to Round Rock, which is the state tournament. And ultimately, that our uh, name up there, our year, state champs. One, two, three, Round Rock!